But it would be kind of ironic if we had, hey, it's uh, Slice Lona. Being our intelligent actor. Now, no knock against him. I love Sly. I'm just saying, though, if we're looking at Sly's history in films, we're not really thinking like deep thought movies, right? All right, so we're back here to our cozy job over at Netflix, making your movies based on your suggestions. So with the last two videos I've mentioned, if you leave me some ideas in the comments, I would try to make your films happen or your TV series happen. So I have a lot of them here today. I hope you guys are enjoying this. I'll do a bit more, assuming you guys are enjoying it. So let me know in the comments if I'm leaving a thumbs up and I should do more of this. But for today, before we get to your suggestions and ideas, um, I will direct you over to this. We have almost a million now. I had to pick up a commission job because we were flat broke. After a couple of that last movie that bombed, flat broke, we needed money to make some things happen, so I got a commission job. I succeeded alone, and um, we're up to one mil, which is great. Now, this gives us the option to go over to research, or actually, yeah, it's research. Before anything else, I want to make my own technology kit for movies. So, I'm going to spend 15 points on this one right here. And I'm not sure what this does, but it lets me use like different type of visuals that are my own. So I guess we kind of skip the entire licensing thing. So I have that, but we could go even further. We are going to drop into at least for now. We could do, we have Mono Perspective V1, but we go over to visual quality instead. Same for sound. I think I'm going to pick a visual quality and quality sound and add those to the pre-existing mono sound and hopefully it kind of evens out. If not, we'll unlock the other ones later. But for now, I think this will do. Let's see, research and quality sound as well. And with this done, we should now be able to go into commissions. We're at a research point, so unfortunately, I'll have to wait a bit to unlock new themes, but that's fine. Uh, let's go over to technology kit now. What do we name this? We're gonna call this the Falcone. That's not how you spell that. The Falcone Six Niner. We'll use visual quality. Considering this is like no money, I guess we'll just add it. Hopefully it doesn't bring down the overall value because it's like zero, but who knows. Create. And now, all right, so he's over here making the technology kit. Do I get any research points for this? Because that'd be great. Now, meanwhile, he does this. Let me look at my comments over here for the last video. Um, let's start off with uh, Adro Rate. Adro Rate Poi. I'm sorry if I just butchered your username. You're saying make samurai in medieval. A name is the first samurai, 80% action, and the rest is 25 or 20. Well, if we do 80 action, I don't think we could do 25 or 20 of them, so it's like 10 at the most. But um, the fast, the first samurai, samurai medieval, you got it. We can make that happen. So technology kit is finished now, perfect. We have 14 points, is that, well, you know what, I'll just save them for something. Oh, and how about before we get underway, we hire somebody, we have enough money for it. Sure, hire employee. Um, I guess we'll go with newspaper. It would be nice to go radio, but I don't want to spend my entire money in one hiring. So let's go newspaper. And... Do I got a wait or what? There they are. Okay. So I'm a director myself. We're not looking for a director. We're looking for something that's going to help us elsewhere. So we have cameraman and Luke Rude. We have Sheldon Wooper, cameraman. And Tom Curse, as opposed to Tom Curse. So I guess we have to pick up the cameramans because, um... I'm already the director. So Luke Rude, welcome aboard. Great, your team grows, but care. Do not hire too many employees at the same time, otherwise they will need some induction time. What does the hell does that mean? Medieval and Samurai. So setting will be Medieval. Theme will be... Samurais, there it is. For second right there, I didn't have it. TV stations, Netflix, OBH, DNN. Is that supposed to be like CNN? Um... We have enough for this, but I don't think we should be spending too big just yet. So let's just stick to Netflix for now. I shall be the director here, Luke Root. Step aside. I'm still the boss. And Technology Kid will we'll use the Falcon 69er for a fact. And project size. I think we start off small first just to see how things go, right? Yeah, let, let's not go crazy. Hopefully we have a hit on our hands and it makes just a lot of money. But we probably shouldn't go medium and fail and lose all of our money so quickly, right? So start to production right now. And let's see how this does for us here. Now, based on the fact that we have a cameraman and a director now, these two right here should be the ones to go really high up. We'll probably fall back a little bit on these two over here. But, you know, what? Falcon's like a 45 on the other stats, so it shouldn't be too low. Define your story. Remember combination. All right, so action, very important. We're definitely going to go 80 and just forget everything over here. Just 10, 10, 80. I know Adro right? 
set 25 or 20 on the rest, but if we're doing 80 action, we could only drop 10 on the other ones, so that's gonna have to do right there. Um, and who are we using for this one? Look, it's not my idea, but people told me in the comments, well, if I use the same actor for movies, it's almost like using the same combination theme over and over. It's gonna lower the amount that it does, so even though Britney Sword would be ideal for this, we're gonna go Bedney for this one. And hopefully along the way, also level her up and, you know, get her a couple of extra points. We are using our technology kit for a fact, so let's dump everything in there. So we could have dropped them in the other ones too, it sort of like increased the numbers, but we might as well just use them for what they excel at. So audio and apparent design won't be too great for this one, but either way. Don't make mistakes in post-production. There we go. So let's give them a couple of extra seconds here and hopefully add a couple of extra points. I would like to add audio to at least 20 if we could, but our numbers are looking really great. This is probably the highest thing that I've produced thus far in terms of raw numbers alone. All on S Films, we are big fans of the Band of Sisters. We currently study at the Netflix University and would like to make a fan movie about it. This is okay. So whoever of you guys told me to make the Band of Sisters, apparently your movie was big enough that people want to make a fan movie about it. Let's allow it. We got 800 fans from that alone. Very good. More fans means more money for us. So New Technology Kid gave us 100% Multiplicator and Olsa's awesome combination for effect, which is the Evil Samurai. Luke Root leveled up, no surprise there. And we have new researchers available as well. Bethany Lawrence did not level up, but we got her some experience. So let's see how this one does. We're looking for something big here. You know, we've done better with less before. I mean, I've reached eights alone when I was still living in my apartment, so I'm a little disappointed, but sure. At least we got a 5.5 rating, which is still pretty bad for a movie, but whatever. Luckily, we did have 33 research points, so we should be able to unlock some new things over here. Let's come on over to Sierra's report. Pop this open. First week gave us 21,000. And we gotta pay this boy 6.3 thousand a week, too, so that's another expenditure right there. Medieval Samurais is very good for the story of the theme. Action is very important. Humor is less important. Well, luckily, our viewers seem to be going up, which is very good. Um, Alright, we got 41 research points. Do we get more themes? I'm thinking yes, but at the same time... I'm not sure what a cheap character does. Or a sidekick, for that matter. 100,000 seems like a bit too much. I'm curious about cheap character. Does that mean like it's going to give me like another available worker? 15? Whatever, do it. Let's see what it does. I'm not sure what the hell that does, but we'll just figure it out. Let's pick up drugs. Would have been good to have that whenever we made the Fixing Bad series. But we can always come back to it. Make a real Fixing Bad series. So, we got drugs. Do I have enough for at least one more theme? Yes, I do. Everything costs 10 now. Hospital could work. I mean, we can make, like, ER. ER was huge for a very, very long time. Isn't ER still, like, running today? And yo, this fast first Samurai movie is getting, like, a lot of, like, late viewers. That's awesome. Alright, so check this out. I think that maybe the cheap character that we unlocked gave us a chance to create a protagonist. No designer available. You need a designer in your team in order to create a new protagonist. Oh, so we still had to hire somebody else. Okay, so we'll have to wait on that one for now. But if we get a designer hired, we'll get that too. Okay, so here we go. Let's see. We have Angelina. Just Angelina, one name. But we're looking for a designer if we want to make this character happen. So, Paul Goodman. Is that like Saul Goodman? Let's go with Lynn... Oh, Game of Thrones. I got you. Lewin Lannister. Okay, very nicely played. Um, yes, we shall add you. There it is. Alright, let's go over to protagonist. Create protagonist. And obviously Lannister will take care of this one. Choose a designer to let him create a protagonist. Keep the designer's attributes in mind. Well, I'm hoping that um, you give me something that's not action-oriented, even though we do a lot of those, but I I'm looking for, eventually, once we unlock humor stuff, we need something for humor as well. So something fairly big in that could be useful. All right. To be honest with you, you kind of gave me the stats for one of the characters we almost already have, technically. So I guess... No, no, no knock on my boy, because I love him. But it would be kind of ironic if we had, hey, it's uh, Slice Lona, being our intelligent actor. Now, no knock against him. I love Sly. I'm just saying, though, if we're looking at Sly's history in films, we're not really thinking like deep thought movies, right? 
So I think it would be kind of amusing, so let's go with Sly Sloan as our intelligence movie expert. Alright, so I'm thinking we go with Zyberian for this one. I... hopefully that's how you say your name. It's XY. Every time I, every time I see XY, I get confused. I think it's Zyberian. Change Die Hard, which I love. One of my favorite movies of all time. What gave you that idea? Oh, you know, just look at the username. Uh, to Live Easy. Okay, so we're gonna go Live Easy, City Drama, 25000 for the Netflix one. I mean, we could also go, we could try OBH. Oh, that's gonna be 450 no, that's way, that's way too much. Yeah, let's just go with this one here. So start production of that one right here. And hopefully it, um, it's not too much of a expenditure at least for this project. The problem now is action. Where do you think action falls in for a city drama? Very good question. 201070, let's go with 201070. A little bit of action in there, but primarily we are going complexity here for this one. You know what's uh, kind of cool about this? I think Sly Stallone might be our most complex actor. So this is definitely a movie as his first film for Sly. Because Bettany's a 12, what's Sly? Oh, perfect! All right. The world can get the first taste of her boy Sly Stallone. Wouldn't have it any other way. Designer, they're over here. Cameraman, over there, Falcon. Gotta get a good script here, boy. 37, 43, and 41. Not too bad. And we're almost done here. And then we just gotta fix up those mistakes. The only thing that we're kind of like missing out right now is like a good quality sound guy. But everything else is not too bad. Right, so what do we got here? Hey! 7676, not too bad at all. I mean, we've done better, I've done better on my own, but it's still fine, I'll accept it. Director Falcon 69 was good. The protagonist Slice Alone was not bad. It's fine, you'll, you'll get to know Slice soon. The story was really good, the setting theme city drama was fantastic. Alright! So that was Zyberian, I believe. Good job, buddy. You got us something hopefully here good. Now, are the fans gonna love it? Oh, we forgot to market it, though. Mmm, should have marketed. Could have probably made even a lot more money. But all things considering, I believe in the sense it's already kind of paid itself off. And it's still paying more money. Very good. Yeah, it's on me. I should have marketed. I forgot all about the marketing part. Um, you know what I'll do? Let's do the series report and let's do a commission. I gotta send these boys on vacation, too, huh? Alrighty, uh, Luke Rude. Vacation. Is it both of you or is it just you? I guess it's just him. What about themes? Time travel. Yeah, yeah. Let's pick up... Oh, we have a documentary as well. Let's pick up document... Let's pick up some more themes. As much as I would like to increase the quality of our stuff, I think having, like, a different variety of, like, different movies that we can make is fairly good. And one for re time travel, I imagine complexity would be important. Which means we could boost up Slice Alone a bit more too, right? So, animals, business, horror, that's what's up. Alright, now we're getting into the nitty gritty over here. Post-apocalypse. Okay, so we used to pull over points on that, but that's fine. I guess there's plenty of chances to make some films. I'm gonna go with, um, I want to make a time travel one because we just unlocked it. So it would give us a chance to like, you know, hopefully get a good theme combination as well. Um, how about we take a spin on Apollo 13. But this time it's going to be apparently, according to Akasha Snow, Apollo 69. So I'm all about that for a fact. Apollo 69er. This time it's going to be a time traveling thing. So just for the premise of hopefully making money, I'm going to make it future and time travel. But I'm still using your title. So TV stations will use Netflix over here. And I shall be the lead director on this one. No salary, that's very good to see. Technology kid. I feel like our technology thing is like, you know, outdated at this point, but eh. You know, we'll go back to small, but this time we are gonna market. Um, and we also need to start getting some more technology, but I, I used all my points just now to unlock some new themes, but I'm happy about it because this gives us a chance to use a lot more of your ideas, especially out of the appropriate themes to make the things you guys request. And I also gotta level these boys up too with some of these points, so. I gotta, like, farm some research off cameras more than likely what I'm thinking. Now, when it comes to future and time travel, this is something completely new. I have to imagine the complex is gonna be up there, so this will be another Sly Stallone film. Future and time travel. Like... I mean, for a fact, complexity has to be either at 70 or higher. Everything else is a matter of just us testing it, so how about we just go, like, at 15 and 15? And hopefully when the series report comes out, it gives me like an, a bigger understanding of what I'm looking for here. But we'll drop a couple of points into the other and see what's up. Our numbers right now are looking kind of good all around. 
As long as we go up to that 40 average, it should be fine. We're gonna go back to Sly Stallone. Although, yeah, I mean, I do want to level him up. But you guys told me using the same character back to back does also drop the thing. L let's give this one over to Bethany for now. Just to kind of switch it up. Plus, she already has her own fan base, too. Let's also go into marketing. And that's way too much money. Let's go to print. And rate. Can't milk it too much because I gotta pay these guys like weekly as well. New theme, awesome combination. I'm glad we went with future and time travel. And it seems like we might have to send one of those boys on vacation pretty soon. Six, seven, seven, and a five, huh? Ah, uh, you know, that five kind of dropped the overall. The story was really good, the team was bad. The director, 69, Falcon 69 was nice. The setting theme combination, future time travel was fantastic. What do you mean the team was bad? Like the overall squad? Is that what you're telling me? The team was bad. I'm, I'm, it's very vague what it means. But we did put in some marketing, so let's see. Not, the numbers aren't too bad. 6.25. But we had some marketing too, so I'm hoping that'll go for a couple of weeks. 34,000. Let's do the series report on that one too. And let's go ahead and just send your ass on vacation. Meanwhile, I bring up these research points up over here. Money-wise, I mean, it's going up third week. Fourth week, still going uh, it's evening out a little bit. Future time travel is a perfect combination. Complex is important. Yeah, I figured as much. And Apollo 69 is starting to drop here a little bit now. 560-something. Did we break even? Sure, we broke even. I think maybe we were like at 600 when it first started. We'll see how it goes. All right. Well, I think we're out of time. I'm going to wrap it up here. I'm going to do a commission off camera to get some more money. And if you guys do want to continue to see more of this, let me know in the comments and we'll come back and do some more of your ideas. If you want to leave some ideas behind, do so in the comments down below. You don't have to give me a theme combination. Just title is fine and I'll try to work things out that make sense. So hopefully we make some money here. But if there's enough interest, we'll keep going with it, obviously. If there is not, then we'll wrap it up here. But hopefully you guys enjoyed it. All the information for the game will be down below if you want to pick it up for yourselves. I will catch you next time.